Hi, I'm Andrea Davis with One Smart Cookie Canine Services in Lacombe, Alberta. This is Calypso. We call her Callie. She is an 11 week old Dalmatian puppy and is doing very well with her training. So I'm using her to demonstrate some of these uh, tricks and behaviors. So today we are doing balance beam. Now, if you want your setup um, fairly simple, and to be able to progress it, I suggest getting a couple of two by fours um, and some cinder blocks or some cement blocks. And how you're gonna start this is put two two by fours together, strap them together, don't set them onto anything yet. Have your dog walk across so they get comfortable without being elevated. And then you're gonna set them up um, on the cinder blocks, very slightly elevated, close together, uh, so they're right together, there's no space between them, and have your dog get comfortable walking across that. That is balance beam, and that's a fairly easy setup. You don't have to use that, and I'm gonna show you what, um, what my setup is, um, but the two by fours are a great way to be able to progress to the double beam, because you can gradually, start spacing them and then the dog walks on two uh, separate surfaces, right, really. So two different beams. Um, but for this level, it's just one beam and it's wider. So they, they get used to just walking on something elevated, fairly skinny and a little bit elevated off the floor. What I'm going to do is use, um, it's actually a cargo ramp for getting into vehicles. It's got kind of a sandpaper surface on it. And the reason I'm using it is simply because that's what I have. And I'm using two blue nine climbs that are very low to the floor. So I've got the legs taken out and the safety plugs in um, because she's a puppy. And I'm just gonna show you what that is. Good girl. She is, you can see she's very interactive likes to do lots of things. So again, how you can start this process is have your dog walk across the beam. You can use a lure, Callie. And you can actually set your treats down so they're not looking up at you. That would be preferable to just luring them along because you can see where she's looking She's not looking where her feet are, and that can cause her to fall off. So if I just set them, like so, that causes her to go across. When your dog is doing it on their own, you're gonna reward them at the end, and then you're gonna elevate onto the platforms. Good. And I'm just gonna get her going away so I can set this up. And as you can see, there's no fear at all. Good girl. Good girl. And that's the balance beam. Have a good day.